here on Friday, March 2nd, kind of late in the evening, but that's just the way our Friday went. Uh, the question this week was presented to us by Dwight Wee, asking if, um, he said he was aware that we had a list of long questions, but I have one more to add to the pile. How do you feel about racism within paganism? and heathenry, heathenry, and how do we, as a community, change that? Well, in my, on my path of paganism, which has been 20 plus years, I have not run across any racism. So I really can't tell you what my opinion is, because I haven't come across it. And I have a wide circle of pagan and uh, Norse followers, and I guess I can't give a very good opinion on what I would do to change it since I haven't come across it. It's very, uh, it's a good question. I just haven't come across anything like that. And the second part of the question was also about sexism within paganism. And again, how do we change that? Thanks and blessed be. Joe. Well, um, I've never come across any sexism either. Maybe I'm, I attend very huge rituals and outings twice a year with 300 and more of my closest pagan friends and with within all the small groups and the larger groups I've never come across either the racism or the sexism uh, and if I did I would uh, be I don't know how I would handle it because I haven't come across it yet. Uh, I think we can't change people. We can show them maybe how it might be a better way to act. But um, in my com pagan community, I've never experienced either one of these. I wish I could be more enlightening, but I can't. So. Joe? Good question. Can't help. Everyone have a great March weekend and I look forward to answering the question next week. Maybe earlier this time. Dancing Rabbit will wind things up for the week tomorrow. Be prepared for a big change. That's all I'm going to wet your whistles with. Peace and love. See you.